Hi everyone. Ford has teamed up once again with its Chinese partner Jiangling Motors for another new model plan to be sold exclusively in the China. If the name rings a bell in your mind, that's probably because Ford unveiled the large three-row equator in March this year. This new SUV shares its name but Chinese media reports it's not based on the same bones. The Equator Sport features the same large radiator grille at the front flanked by thin LED headlights with C-shaped DRLs. The side profile is muscular with wide wheel arches hiding 20-inch wheels and plastic cladding in the lower section of the doors. The rear end is also very similar, though the smaller model doesn't have a LED stripe connecting the taillights. Inside the cabin, there's room for five passengers, whereas the larger Equator can be had with either six or seven seats. The dashboard design features the same dual-screen layout, though the surrounding trim looks a little less glitzy. Under the hood is a 1.5-liter turbocharged gasoline engine, for which Ford says is brand new and this is its first application in a production model. The peak output of this unit is 170 horsepower, 127 kilowatts, and 192 pound-feet, 260 newton-meters, of torque. It is mated to an automatic transmission though we don't know whether it sends power to the front or to all four wheels. The claimed maximum speed is 112 miles per hour, 180 kilometers per hour. Price in China starts at 169.800 and ends at 221.800 yuan, $26.330 to $34.380. The Ford Equator and the new Ford Equator Sport are manufactured at the JMC Ford joint venture, previously known as Jiangling Ford. Thank you for watching the video, and do not forget to support us, like and subscribe to the channel. I wish you a happy day.